with this expedition, I think uh, we started not knowing each other at all. Um, but there was already really a lot of trust amongst the team members because just because we are talent and we share the same values. I've been really impressed on this trip with the colleagues I've met from around the, the Talon group. I've only joined the group in the last six months and this was a great opportunity to meet people and see how uh, different teams from different countries can quickly learn to work together, communicate and trust each other. We had to climb the mountain and, and we had to trust our colleague who's holding us with the rope. And it's a very special feeling that you know that your life depends on, on someone you feel you can go further if you, you trust uh, your team member who's, who's backing you up, who's encouraging you and empowering you. Blaise shared this graph about you know, where your team is on motivation, where your team is on skills and the different leadership styles. And I think that's very interesting to know that it, it's not just one profile that makes you a good leader and also the importance of adaptability and maybe being recognizing when you need to change your leadership style a little bit depending on how your team is doing, how your team is feeling, what your team needs in that moment. Operational excellence to me has been always technical until now but with this uh, training um, I saw that it was also a matter of building a good team and having everyone together in the same direction and having a plan, I think that was one of my key learnings. The impact of climate change is particularly visible on mountains and glaciers. Being directly confronted to it with experts contributes to our collective awareness. It is key for us to take into account in all our actions. One thing I want to take back uh, to the day job after this trip is how the parallels between the mountain rescue teams and how they plan and work together as, as a team we can use that in our day jobs to really uh, achieve things and work together better by operating very smoothly as a team. One learning I'd like to take back is empowerment, making people believe, feel they can do it, they can do anything. Trying to just give them the confidence, the reassurance, build the trust, but empower others to, to, to succeed.